This is the Gary Post Tribune. They closed in the early 2000s, but unlike most abandoned buildings, they were thriving up until the day they closed. They relocated when Gary's population started to decrease rapidly. The city was falling into disrepair, and the people at the Post Tribune didn't want that to affect their business. So they relocated most of the resources to the neighboring town of Merrillville. The only people left in the Gary building were the couple dozen running the printing presses. And even then, the building was only used for a couple more years. And it's sat abandoned ever since. Day two, let's get it. How does my hair look? Right off the bat, we got this newspaper uh, slide, and there's still newspaper on the, the belt. That's crazy. Oh, hey, it's the old. Uh, the newspaper would, the newspapers would roll down this table. Newspapers are still here. That's crazy. Oh my gosh. The shipping area? Oh my. The shipping area is full of water. That is terrifying. Holy crap. What? That's crazy. Bro, this place is pretty big. Wow. Man, check this out. The cork board has started to bow. I don't know if you can see that. I wonder how deep that is right now. Oh, it's Dude, probably starts like this. It, it's like an apocalypse movie when buildings start to flood or whatever. Like this is what that always reminds me of. This very much reminds me of parts of The Last of Us. You could literally kayak through this. You? Oh my gosh, you could. Wouldn't that be a cool video? That would be fun. You could go down those stairs, but I don't know if I trust that. I will. I'll go structure. I'll go carefully because I'm a good swimmer anyway. I am throwing my camera up in the air. One of you all gotta catch it. Okay. I was about to say, like, no, wait, it's not gonna be that deep. You should be fine. You should hold up above your head. It's gonna be cold as shit. I'll tell you that if I fall. These stairs feel pretty solid. They look good, but. You want a stick or something, Todd, to see how deep it is? Yeah, yeah. Let me see if I can find something. Look down further, further. Watch out for the nails. Yeah, watch it. It's got nails and I'm going to be real. It's real light. You just be easy with it. Here we go. Don't throw it. I'm not going to throw it, you moron. Okay, right here. Pull it back up. So right to that first nail. Right to the... Two, two feet? Yeah, right to that nail. Two feet of water, give or take. You know what this kind of reminds me of, actually? The amnesia levels with the water monster. Damn, a spiral staircase that leads right down to the water. That's pretty cool. I imagine this was like a storage area. 
Wow. Check that out. There's a basketball hoop. Probably had like probably play basketball on their brakes. Let's see. Hey guys, check this out. Come here. It's a door doing. One for the I know, I've been waiting for it. No, no. I didn't want to do it too much because I'm always worried it's going to get overdone, and so I'm like, I just got to wait. Some sort of manifesto. Um, I think it's their uh, receiving and shipping logs. Hmm. Oh, this light is really nice. Thank you for letting me have Yeah, oh. I found a bunch of newspaper, Todd. Really? Yeah, they're all stacked up in here. I found a couple of Two thousand five. Wow. Oh, that's fun. Saturday. Yeah, the hallway. How did I miss that? What? Oh my gosh! How did I miss that? That's grody. Well, that explains the rancid smell in here. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Ew, I wonder how it died. I don't know, keep going. Look at all the maggots around it, ugh. Oh, hey, check this out. Cool. Probably doesn't work out for us. A possum died it. Of all creatures. Wow. Oh, this was like the, this was like the writer's office. Yeah, exactly. That's awesome. Oh yeah, I'm starting to smell that possum now. Man, can you imagine? There was somebody who sat at this desk and worked here. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. This was somebody's workspace. It's like I'm in an abandoned version of the office. Right. What's this? Some sort of old media guide. There's some great huh. cool opportunities in here. Wild. Oh, it does. Oh, it's like a good one. Yeah, in the image, you're there. Oh, check that out. I found a photo album of a trip to Washington. Hmm. Ooh, this must have been the chief's office. Like the big, the head honcho, or one of them anyway. This is like where J. Jonah Jameson would sit. <laughs> You're fired! Hey, yeah, look, this is the firing chair, I'll bet you. Hmm, like a map of the North American newspaper mills. That's kind of neat. Oh, wow. Found the stairs. Yeah, we did. That's perfect. This is the other side we wanted to check out. So. Yeah, and right on, the, right on the other side of there is where we just were. The writer's office. This is a server room. That's what it looks like over there, at least. There's a the front office for a front desk right here. Oh my goodness. I don't know what this was. Hmm. But it went, oh, that, wow. That car just stopped right in front of that freaking window. With the daylight, I don't think it'll be that noticeable, brother. Dude! 
That is sick. <laughs> you gotta see this, Jay. It's the old security cameras. Oh, that is cool. It says advertising department and they cross it out and wrote Dom department. <laughs> like I hate I hate when people come in here, come into abandoned buildings and just draw penises everywhere. But that's, but that's fun. kinda funny. That's I'm not funny. gonna lie. That is funny, I'll do that. Advertising and display dispatch. Mac, like one of the ones that we used in school. Actually, that's older. We used the colored ones. That's just like the first one. I wonder if it's still in there. Ooh, a private office. That means go in. It's like an office, but it's private. Oh, it's locked. How dare they? Damn. Look at that. A first aid kit with all the shit still in it. That's pretty cool. Bathroom. Oh, what is this? That's maybe sick. This, maybe this is like what folded them? Maybe. Or, you know, wrapped them up. I yeah, guess. that's crazy. I can't believe this hasn't been scrapped yet. So this is where they would probably like fold the newspaper and get it ready for distribution. And then they would put it on this thing and send it down the spiral. That's sick. Whoa, what is this? What is this? Methods Research Corp. It's like a magnet board, but I'm, I don't understand. I don't understand what, like, why the magnets are assorted to different days. McDonald's, Michaels, Target. Maybe certain days with certain advertising spots or something. I don't know. News America, Kmart. Maybe this is. Oh, you know what? Maybe this is where they deliver to every day. Hmm. Exactly. Yeah, cause Circuit City is on here twice, like a couple times. And Best Buy and Target. That's probably what it was. That's crazy. Oh wow, check this out. I don't know what this was. Oh, cafeteria. Some of the seating areas still left. That's sick. What? Dude. It's old film. It's old, like, like, old, old pictures. Whoa. That's cool. That's awesome. Oh, look at this. It's an old film roll. Damn. Here's the turntable where they would slot the pictures in. You take this picture. And you slot it right in there like that. 
and it turns on that projector. And it, that's how it shows the pictures. And then I'm pretty sure this right here is an old camera that they used to like film old, old stuff like this. That's sick. Four seventy-five an hour. How much? Four seventy-five. Yeah. October first, nineteen ninety-six. That was like the minimum wage. Can you imagine only working for four dollars an hour? Dude, that's Granted. crazy. Granted, it was probably worth a lot more back then. Oh yeah. Now minimum wage is up to like fifteen an hour. And that's barely enough. Yeah. That's gonna wrap it up for this one. On to the next one. Yep. Let's go. Sorry, Todd. No, you're good. There's if I turn it off, then it's really dark. No,